Hey Zim, my name is Alex Stemley. I'm the President and CEO of Stemley Consulting Group. And in this video, I'm going to show you three things that you can do today to help bring in more customers to your business. Now, most likely you're sitting there asking yourself, why would I be doing this and what's in it for me? Well, you're lucky because I read minds and the answer is, oftentimes in the world of the internet, most local business owners are too busy running their business to learn how the internet can benefit them and their company. It's sometimes the only hesitation that, so that someone has to hiring someone is they don't know who the expert is and who isn't. I have found by giving people an easy free attack plan of actual things that they can do to impact their business for free, it's actually resulted in some of those local business owners still raising their hands and saying, I like you, Alex, please do this for me. So if by the end of this video, you've liked what you've heard and you can see that I have a lot of tricks up my sleeve that can help your business with getting more clientele and revenue, please shoot me a message back and we can chat. Or if at the end of this video, you simply want to take this free attack plan I gave you to do yourself, that works for me too. So now let me show you three things that will set your company above your competition and not waste any more of your time or mine. The first thing I want to talk about is content. Now, what content is, is anything that you can see on a web page. Now, unfortunately, I couldn't find an actual full web page uh, of yours other than Facebook. Uh, and Facebook is a great, great start. But realistically, uh, in the world of the Internet and world and businesses out there, you really want to have your own uh, customized website for you. It shows your brand. It shows who you are. It shows everything. Like I said, Facebook is a nice thing to have, but it really looks more professional when you get on and when you have an actual website. Now, talking about websites, one big thing that you really want right away, like I said, is content. So anything you can see on that website. Uh, now, Google likes there to be at least 1,500 words on that home page to optimize you uh, efficiently. Uh, now, not only do they are they looking for words, uh, and you know words can be content, pictures can be content, all of the above, but they're looking for something called keyword rich content. Now, what a keyword is is anytime you go in Google, for instance, if I go over here and I type in photography DFW, well, that is considered a keyword. So, in the content on the home page. Uh, we would want to put as many keywords as we could and how do we figure out what keywords to put in there well luckily here at Stemley Consulting Group we do have uh, the tools and the ability to see what is the most popular uh, things being searched in your area that you're that you're looking to gain clientele in we then put those words throughout the content now unfortunately it's not just as easy as hey getting it and putting it in a hundred times uh, unfortunately Google is very picky when it comes to that they actually will consider that if you put too many times in there they'll consider that keyword stuffing because it is not organic so we have an algorithm here that we know exactly where to place it when to place it and how to place all the keywords in there to really uh, you know optimize you the best possible way okay so I've actually pulled up some other competition in, in the area just to kind of show you uh, just kind of what other people are kind of doing so you see Rachel Freeman photography here very beautiful page very professional looks great uh, just as you can see there's not a lot of content on there so this would not be very hard to take out uh, the competition here content wise uh, so let's see here actually sitting at only 544 words so about a thousand off on that page okay not hard to take out at all we just need to you know get up there so let's actually see what she's getting found for so 544 words then I have this program that I use it's called RF I pay about $400 a month for it, but it gives me all the analytics I can ever need on every web page so as you can see she's actually getting found for 331 keywords which pretty good so it's actually bringing her about 400 people to her website a month and we'll get into what these other things mean here shortly mainly the backlinks but uh, kind of showing you you know 331 keywords she's getting found for bringing in about 400 people to the website then I also have this one here pulled up called Lindsay Walden fine art photography another very beautiful page very professional looking uh, but again as you can see there's not a ton of content on here uh, let's kind of see where she's at uh, let's see, she's getting found for, she's getting found for 2,000, almost 2,000 keywords. So that's a big piece of it. Uh, she may, may not have a huge amount of content, but her entire domain is getting found for almost 2,000 words or content or pictures or, you know, with keywords and things on there. It's bringing her about 870 people to her website a month, okay? So these are huge numbers. This is where we want to get you. This is definitely, you know, uh, what you would strive to do to get that kind of clientele in and do really what you need to do. Now, 
The next thing I really want to talk about with you is something called Google My Business, or some people refer to it as GMB, or just the Map Pack. And what that is, again, anytime you type in something in a search bar, so Photography DFW, little map shows up, and then three businesses underneath that map. Well, number one, why would you want to be on that, in that Map Pack? Number two, what does it matter if you're in the top three? Uh, you know, and how do you how do you get in there? Well. Uh, number one, why would you want to be on there? Because, well, generally that's the first thing people are going to see when they type something in the search bar. Uh, why would you want to be in the top three? Well, pretty simple. Uh, when I'm looking for something, I'm going to type that in. I'm going to look at those top three because our brain, just as human beings, tells us that they must be the best. Whether that's right or wrong, they must be the best. That's why they're getting all kinds of clientele. But how do you get on there and how do you get up to that top three? Well, number one, you register with Google. So you get a Google My Business uh, directory listing. On there, they want to know, you know, uh, exact company name, exact address, hours of operation. Um, they'd like a description on there to be 500 words that is keyword rich. They would also like to see at least 20 photos that have keywords behind them. So basically, you're saving uh, on your computer those pictures under keyword names um, from there uh, you have your description you'll have everything up you put all that in there and they want as many five-star reviews as you can get and I saw quite a few great reviews on Facebook which is phenomenal um, but if you can get those reviews on Google it will move you up very very quickly into that top spot or in the top three for sure once you're in that top three you know the the world is is yours um, when it comes you can get as much clientele as you absolutely can handle uh, so a huge boost for for your company. Okay, now the last thing I really want to talk about <clears throat> is probably the most important when it comes to all of it. It's what you call uh, back end SEO, and basically it consists of two things. It consists of citations and backlinks. And what a citation is is it's just a directory. So Google My Business is a directory. Home Advisor, Yellow Pages, White Pages. Uh, you know, Facebook has a place for directories. Instagram has a place for directories for citations. Um, there's hundreds of thousands of these directories out there. We want to get you on as many as absolute possible. I generally don't recommend getting any less than 80 a month. You get 80 a month, it'll move you up pretty quickly, and that's very important. But probably the most important out of all is going to be the backlinks. Now, to optimize you, Google says you need at minimum 250 to 350 backlinks just to get started. So what is a backlink? A backlink is anytime you can go on any web page. Doesn't matter if it's Facebook, Instagram, uh, a blog post, if it's an influencer post, if it's a YouTube video, it does not matter. But it has to say, for instance, the blog, you know, check out my friend Zim uh, right here and there's a link to your website. Okay. They can click on that link and it goes directs them directly to you. That is huge. Why is that so big? Because Google is on a point system. You're on something called domain rating. The rating is from 0 to 100. We want that to be as close to 100 as possible. So not all websites are created equal. You know, I wouldn't want to put you on a Pizza Hut website because you're not slinging pizzas. So that wouldn't give you much power. There wouldn't be much point to that. Uh, we only want to put you on the most powerful websites because then you get the power that they have when there's a backlink to you. So, for instance, we go over here again to the Rachel Friedman Photography, and we look at her backlinks over here. So she has 813 backlinks. It's a good number. So let's see here, domain rating. I can look at everybody's stuff, everything that they're on. So as you can see right away, a 97, that is fantastic. That is phenomenal. 95, great. But then you have a 49 here. That's, you know, middle of the road, not doing a whole lot, but not bad either. Then you have a 4, doing absolutely nothing for. Uh, 77, pretty good. But then you have some 40s, 70s, uh, 26, not very good. Uh, a 1 is terrible. Again, there's a lot of fluff in here. So how do we compete with these other other businesses? Well, pretty simply, we go in and we pick out all the absolute best, the ones with the most power. We copy those. We get on those websites. But then from there, we not only match them, we go above and beyond and we put all kinds of new big ones on there that we know work, uh, that, that really, really help 
small businesses get to the top. Okay. Uh, our goal here at Stemley Consulting Group is not to match the competition. It is to smash the competition. And we have the ability to do that. Okay. Let's go over and look at Lindsay Walden here again real quick and let's kind of see where that's at. So she only has 649 backlinks, but she's bringing in more traffic. My guess is that is because hers have more power. Overall, she has more power. So starting out at the 43, not great, but 85, 97, 87, 50, 91, 50, 91, 90, 91, 91, 91. As you can see, it just keeps going and going with good ones. She doesn't need all that fluff in there. Nobody really does. So we go in, we find the most powerful ones, and we copy, and then we overt overtake the competition, okay? That's how we do things. That's, you know, uh, tried and true. The big thing is, uh, this doesn't happen overnight. It takes time. Like I said, Google wants everything to be organic, so slow and steady wins the race. We, we know ways to make it go, you know, somewhat faster than others. But again, it just takes some time because we want you to be up there the correct way where you're going to be sitting there for a long time and get, you know, all the clientele that you can handle. So just to kind of go over what we went over, what we talked about again today, I don't want to go too far in the weeds. And, you know, if you have questions, we'd be happy to answer them for you at any time. But we went over, number one, we talked about content. Remember your front page of your website, we really need a website and that front page needs to be at least 1500 words. Number two, we talked about the Google My Business, how to, uh, you know, register for that, what they're looking for, and how to get in that top three. And then number three, and probably most importantly, the, the back-end SEO, the citations and the backlinks. Remember, the citations, I wouldn't go under 80 citations a month. And with the backlinks, uh, I you know, minimum, you want 250 to 350 just to get you started. Um, but, you know above and beyond is really where you need to be to get that clientele coming in just looking at some of the competition in the area so with that being said you can either go with this information I provided you with today and do this on your own and I'm totally cool with that however if you want the most effective route and want to save yourself the time you can give us a call here at Stanley Consulting Group at 317-676-4405 and once again my name is Alex Stemley I am the president and CEO of Stemley Consulting Group and again our number here is 317-676-4405 we look forward to hearing from you thanks have a great one